Welcome to the Folktale Project. This is Dan Scholes. Today we have another Brothers Grimm tale because, well, this is a heck of a tale. It's a story about, well, how the animals see us. This is The Wolf and the Man. Once upon a time, the fox was talking to the wolf about the strength of man, how no animal could withstand him, and how all were obliged to employ cunning in order to protect themselves from him. The wolf answered, If I could see a man just once, I would attack him nonetheless. I can help you do that, said the fox. Come to me tomorrow morning, early, and I will show you one. The wolf arrived on time, and the fox took him out to the path which the huntsman used every day. First, an old, discharged soldier came by. Is that a man? asked the wolf. No, answered the fox. He has been one. Afterwards, came a little boy on his way to school. Is that a man? No, he will become one yet. Finally, a huntsman came by with his double-barreled gun on his back and a sword at his side. The fox said to the wolf, Look, here comes a man. He's the one you must attack, but I'm going back to my den. The wolf then charged at the man. When the huntsman saw him, he said, Too bad I have not loaded with a bullet. Then he aimed and fired a load of shot into his face. The wolf pulled an awful face, but did not let himself be frightened, and attacked him again, on which the huntsman gave him the second barrel. The wolf swallowed his pain and charged at the huntsman again, who in turn drew out his naked sword and gave him a few blows with it left and right, so that, bleeding all over, he ran howling back to the fox. Well, brother wolf, said the fox, How did you get along with man? Oh, replied the fox, I never imagined the strength of man to be what it is. First, he took a stick from his shoulder and blew into it, and then something flew into my face which tickled me terribly. Then he breathed once more into the stick, and it flew up my nose like lightning and hail. Then, when I got next to him, he drew a naked rib out of his body and beat me with it so that it almost killed me. See what a braggart you are, said the fox. You throw your hatchet so far that you cannot get it back again. And that is The Wolf and the Man by Jacob and Wilhelm Grimm. And this story comes from children and household tales. And again, while it's a little violent, there at the end in how the wolf is attacked by the man it goes to show how animals with no concept of human technologies can view those technologies and I like it for that I really do This is Dan Scholes for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere you like to get your podcasts. You can follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, iHeart Radio, Spotify, anywhere you'd like to listen. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com where you'll find a new story waiting for you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you'd like to help support the podcast, you can also head over to folktaleproject.com slash support, where you'll find links out to all the different ways that you can help support the podcast. As always, thank you so much for listening. <laughs>